My name is Tom Roden. I own Exchange Coffee on Varden Avenue in the city. Exchange is a specialty coffee bar and cafe. Um, we've been operating for a shade over nine years in this very spot. Uh, we have a, a very strong focus on traceable, ethical and sustainable coffees and of course uh, great food to go along with that. Our experience through COVID was one of a roller coaster really. Um, at the height of the restrictions we were only able to seat nine people inside which uh, had we been restricted to that would have been uh, crippling for us. Outdoor dining has always been uh, critically important, I suppose. And to that end, I've always liked the idea of having a parklet outside. And luckily, uh, the City of Adelaide were very forthcoming to that end. In August 2021, uh, they offered to install us a temporary parklet as part of the Reignite program. So the addition of the extra tables outside really did provide us an extra avenue to be able to seat more people and get us through the, the really tough restrictions of Omicron. We were invited to apply to make the parkland more permanent uh, and we took advantage of that. And now it's, uh, it's a beautifully decked surface which is at the same level of footpath and we've been able to fit it out with nice planters and plants and I think it's a truly wonderful place to sit. The, the community has responded really favourably to the parklet um, in its temporary state but also in its now more permanent state. Initiatives uh, like the Reignite parklet program are I think really important uh, for the City of Adelaide, for its residents and its businesses and, and the people who are going and visit venues. Um, it really contributes strongly to the vibrancy of the city um, and I, I think no one would, would argue with, with the fact that an outdoor dining presence, um, particularly in a precinct like this, is really, it's a, it's a lovely thing. It has a slightly European feel about it. And I, I think it adds a, a great amount to the street appeal where you have those parklets.